what's up everyone welcome back to my channel today i just wanted to make a quick little haul video i just got back from sedona arizona on wednesday um if you haven't been there before it's amazing it's if you're into spirituality or crystals it's the perfect place for you it is really like an energy vortex there's multiple vortexes there made up from the red rocks that are there um it's really cool and yeah everywhere you walk is a metaphysical store that sells crystals and it's perfect so i bought a bunch of them and i just want to show you what i got so i messed up big time and i only brought a carry-on bag on the airplane so it was nice getting there but then on the way back i just bought as many crystals as i could fit and it was just so heavy like my shoulder is in pain still from having like 13 pounds of crystals trying to get up into the airplane thing above your seat it was not working out for me but we made it none of my crystals broke they all came in one piece so i just want to show you what i got today <laughs> most of these crystals i actually bought for other people i feel like every time i travel I just see things that I want to buy for other people or friends or family so I usually do that and then I wish that I bought myself more but I got myself a couple of things but I usually and mostly these are gifts for people but I'm definitely am very happy with what I got and it just gives me more reason to go back and buy more um so the first thing I'll show you I actually bought for myself I didn't know what they were until I went to the counter I just felt really drawn to buy them. I use this as like a backdrop. So focus. Try to focus these. Oh gosh. Focus. There we go. Now they are white adventuring and i love buying crystals that way um it's like the way you're supposed to really is they kind of choose you like you choose whatever um is calling out to you and these were really calling out to me so i'm happy i got them and i loved um a lot of the stores there would give you a little card with what you bought um it tells you like all the properties of the crystal so for white of entry and it says used to facilitate clarity and visions which really um lately i've been having really intense dreams lately so that really popped out at me um can be used with all chakras works especially well with the crown chakra helps to alleviate sleep disorders and helps balance the emotions which is definitely good for me yes i was happy with my purchase i love it so the next thing that I bought, this actually isn't from Sedona, it's from New Mexico. I drove from Texas to Arizona. So I bought this at a Native American store in New Mexico. Sorry, the car's outsider. It's traffic time, you know. But so they actually had really big crystals for not a lot of money, which was great. But I wanted to buy more in Sedona. So I only bought a couple crystals in New Mexico and I should have bought more, but I got this big piece of smoky quartz. It's really pretty. I think it only costs like $11 maybe. And this is like another one of those things where I just felt called to buy this one. There are other pieces that were bigger or like a lot darker, but I just really like the shape of this one and I just felt really called to buy it. So I love it. These two are agate, which I have been pronouncing wrong forever. I always thought it was a gate, but I'm still learning, still just starting out my collection. So I'm still learning that I'm pronouncing things wrong, but these are actually my husband's favorite ones. So I got these for him. This one I actually got from that same store in New Mexico. Um, it's a pretty blue color. And then this one looks really cool with like a light under it. You can see my camera. It's really cool. I got this one in Sedona. I'm just gonna shut my window because the cars are being loud. Okay, so this next one is a really pretty pendant. I'm actually gonna use this again to show it. But it's half kyanite, 
have selenite. It's really pretty. And they gave me cards with these ones too. It says for the selenite, it's a rejuvenator. It enhances the elasticity. Did I say that right? of the skin to gain a more youthful appearance, assists in the regeneration of tissue, relieves stress, enhances willpower, aids past life memory recall, which is really cool, and enhances clairvoyant insights into the future. And then blue kyanite, never needs cleaning, aligns all chakras, promotes wholeness, has a strong calming effect and clearing effect, Balances male and female energies, nurtures intellectual, emotional, and physical body, dispels confusion, enhances meditation, placed between the heart chakra and the navel chakra. Which is perfect for a pendant, and I just think it's so pretty and it's super powerful. It has so many different properties, so. Love that one. Okay, the next one I bought is a really pretty fluorite point. And get the solid background. Does it work? As you can see, it has all pretty colors. It says both the purple and the green, greenish blue. Thought it was really pretty. Jumped right out at me. And that one came with a card. I love when they come with cards, especially when you're giving someone a gift. They don't have a lot of crystals, give them this little card with it, and it's like they know exactly what they're getting. So this one is an intuitive healing stone. Helps progress on many levels, increases concentration, brings order to chaos, good for relationships, deepens your meditation, heals the heart, soothes headaches, migraines, ulcers, and wounds, and good for respiratory resp respiratory tract another powerful stone point crystal <laughs> this is another one that jumped right out at me and i just felt like my friend would love it it looks like a dragon ball or like or something else <gasps> those little eggs that grogu eats in the mandalorian that's what it looks like Got my baby Yoda right there. Okay, and this is honey calcite. Clarity of insight and action, confidence, persistence, and intellectual power. And the chakras are root, solar plexus, and third eye. I just thought it was really pretty and cool and unique. And I want to go buy more of them. <laughs> and now the next one I got is this really pretty amethyst. It is a really deep purple, if you can see. I thought it was really pretty. And I just love what amethyst is, like the really deep purple. So I'm really happy with this one. And oh yes, so there was another store right before I was leaving Sedona after I bought everything. And they had like these wagons outside full of just giant pieces of raw selenite and it was three dollars a pound and it had like a um scale <laughs> whatever those things are called a scale so i was like how many how big of a piece can they fit in my carry-on bag so i got two pieces luckily just fit it um so this is the first one I feel like you just get so much for your money with it. I just felt like I had such a good deal. Um, I love how clear this one is. It's a good size. And it has just like, it's pretty smooth. And I just like the shape of it. A nice piece of selenite. And that one is for a friend. But this one I got for myself. I'm like, I'm gonna buy myself as big a piece as I can get. And so this one jumped out at me. It's really big. But it's so shiny. It's just iridescent and it's nice and smooth. And it just feels so powerful. It came 
from Sedona charged in a vortex and I just feel like it's giving me such good energy and it's clearing out anything bad and I just love it so much. I have it in my room right now. Well, not right now, but usually <laughs> since Wednesday night, but I love it. I'm so super happy with it. I think it was like three pounds. So what did I say? Like $9, I think for this giant piece. It feels, sounds like a good deal to me. I would have bought the whole wagon if I could. Okay, and this next one I really love. And it's my first fossil. I'm, my dream in life is to be an archaeologist. But... I don't, know off. <laughs> I don't know where it is. So my dream in life is to be an archaeologist. Or it was if I ever got my master's degree. But... I want to start collecting fossils. So I bought this. And it's a trilobite. Now I'm gonna need some. If any fossil experts are watching this, after I got this and I was home and I was researching researching trilobites because I know that I think they went the last ones went extinct like 240 million years ago or something. So I was like, wow, that's insane that they just you can just buy one, right? But I saw that people fake them a lot, so then I was getting paranoid. Like, what if it? What if it's fake? So that's why I need someone to tell me. Like, I do see, like, the little edges, but I don't know. It kind of looks like it's painted, but, um, and usually they're black, but this one's brown. So, I don't know. I'm hoping it's real, but if it's not, no big deal. Apparently, it has properties. I didn't realize that fossils would also have properties. And this is aids those in leadership and management roles, helps one to achieve goals, supports eye health, headaches, patience and fortitude, perseverance and patience, and the chakra is the root. So whether it's fake, whether it's real, if I put that intention or that belief that it's going to help me achieve my goals, it's going to help me achieve my goals. So I'm not too worried about it, but it would be really cool if it was real, but yep. Just let me know, fossil experts. My goal is to just become a fossil collector now. Gotta learn. I gotta learn what's fake and what's real. I was just excited to see fossils. They literally sold, like, megalodon teeth. It was crazy. I was like, I didn't even realize you could buy that stuff. So now I know what I want for Christmas is um, a megalodon tooth. Probably a million dollars. But yes, I hope that you all enjoyed my video. I definitely want to go back to Sedona so bad this time. I'm bringing a uh, empty bag just for crystals or I'll just ship them all back to my house. But yeah, I did realize that it was cheaper. I could get more for my money going out of Sedona. Um, even the crystals that I bought outside of Sedona or I brought some personal ones for my house. Um, when I went there, I just charged them when I like, oops, when I hiked up to the one of the vortexes. I just put my crystals out for a little bit and I just charge it so you're still getting that energy it doesn't really matter where you get it from but it everything is super powerful there so I was just happy to have a bunch from there and I'm really excited about it but yes let me know if you enjoyed this video <laughs> if you did enjoy it please like the video and subscribe to my channel I hope everyone has a great week weekend whenever you're watching this I love you peace out